live stream, live stream, live stream. Paano yun? So, ganito lang. Currently, ginagamit ko na yung OBS Studio para sa tutorial. Iusog ko muna yung video ko dito sa gilid. To begin with, kailangan lang natin ng dalawang application. OBS Studio and second one is A Power Mirror. So, we have to download it from Google. You have to search obsproject.com. From there, you'll see their different option depending on your OS. I'm using Windows, so I'll click on Windows. It will automatically download an installer for me. Then, while waiting for that, search A Power Mirror. The first link will give you an option to download the installer for the power mirror so you just click on download after you download the two installer you just have to simply install just click on the installer and click on yes so next thing kailangan din natin mag download ng a power mirror available siya sa play store so punta lang kayo ng play store then search nyo a power mirror lalabas na siya rito then click on install open a power mirror on your screen you can open the application from your android phone then this is how it should look like you can continue with trial click nyo lang yung kulay blue sa gitna and then click on a power soft desktop click on phone screen mirroring then click on start now automatically your screen will Will be shared to your desktop then after that you have to open the mobile legends application there you go once you open the mobile legends application and go back to obs studio first thing you have to do is you have to go to the sources right click and then add choose windows capture click on ok then you have to search for a power mirror main once you click on it, automatically lalabas sa screen nyo yung Mobile Legends. So you just have to simply resize it. I-switch nyo lang siya rito. Iangat nyo yung video nyo para kayo na ulit yung makikita. Pwede nyo rename yung scene to Facebook Live. So after that, kailangan nyo mag-set ng background kasi nakikita nyo naman may mga kulay black dito sa taas saka dito sa baba. So add lang kayo, then click on image, and then click on OK. You have to browse for background image na gusto nyo. Sa akin, I have one one, kasi favorite hero ko yan. And click on OK. So medyo malaki yung background na nakuha ko, so I just have to simply resize it. Ayan. So iilalim nyo lang siya ulit para yung mobile nyo, saka yung video nyo yung nasa taas. Ilock nyo yung video capture and window capture, pati yung image ng background. Ilock nyo yan para hindi nyo sila magagalaw. After nyan, kailangan nyo pumunta sa settings. Sa settings, make sure na meron kayong audio microphone na available. Pag naka-disable yan, walang marinig na sound sa inyo. Then, click on OK. Then, lastly, go back to settings. Then, click on stream. And then, there should be a stream key kung saan kayo mag-live. For example, mag-live tayo dito sa Facebook. Kailangan nyo pumunta sa Facebook page nyo. And then, you have to copy the stream key. After nyo makopy yung stream key, paste nyo lang yan sa OBS Studio. And then, click on OK. Okay na. Pwede na kayo mag-start ng live streaming ninyo. Ang last na kailangan nyo napindutin is yung mag-dual screen tayo para mas makita nyo. So, yan. Ready na kayo for live streaming. Pwede nyo i-rename na lang yung caption nyo or yung title nyo for your live. Once na pinindot nyo yung start streaming dito, click natin yung start streaming. After nyo pindutin yung live streaming, magkakaroon kayo ng option to click on go live. So, wait nyo lang yung video. So, yan. Available na yung video nyo sa page nyo. Pwede nyo nang i-click yung go live. So yun, ganito na yung live stream. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you have any comments or suggestions, please write down below. And please do not forget to click on subscribe. Thanks.